Hola chicanos. Do a uh, righteous ram to Aries real quick. Holy Spirit, take me to the soul cycle of Aries, please. Faded event. Ten of Pentacles. Ooh, ten, ten. This adds up to this. Calls down divine judgment. Twenty. Sword sailing on the pond of waters. A student. Seven. Cancerian energy. Forward movement, gaining control of your environment and victory. Ooh, six of wands. Part of the situation is victory. Oh, what's in the challenge position for Aries? Four of Wands is an achievement of some kind. Am I getting a different perspective of things? Um, a page of, or a uh, slow, diligent knight, honorable and uh, in high standing. Maybe slow moving, but gaining ground inch by inch. 12, this is 14, 16. So that's a tower, and then this is um, 17. Aquarius energy. So that's up to Aquarius energy. Okay. Okay. Subconsciously, what is the Aries thinking of? Subconsciously, thinking of uh, lights being shed on some kind of. Uh, Skilled person, a skilled person. This adds up to 20, divine judgment. Hmm. It's twice that's come out now. So light's being shed on the magician. Somebody who is a skilled, skilled, tricky bastard. We got in the um, past. How the fuck did we get here? Aries? Past somebody was passionate about insanity. Passion, maybe their passions led them to insanity. So that's up to 10, a completion of that. So maybe this is a completion of that. Somebody's passions led them to maybe go a little crazy. Uh, okay. Uh, so what were their passions? Holy Spirit. Okay, something to do with the, the religion. Maybe they became a fanatic or went like off the deep end or something. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Hmm, it adds up to 15. The devil, okay. Maybe they got into witchcraft and taking it. Witchcraft sent them off the deep end. That makes sense. That, that happens all the time. <coughs> Okay, presently, um, somebody's either faith, hope, and healing, or there's an Aquarius in your energy, presently. One of this Aquarius. Okay. The uh, Aquarius and a Sagittarius. This could be a Sagittarius. This could be a spirit team. So that's a 14, 17, 20, 31. So that could be 31. One. It could be going through a period of transformation. The 13. What do we got in the future? This one? In the future, there's an emperor. This is your energy, Aries. So this is you in the future. I'm taking it. Um, ruling with an iron rod there. This is... Um, yeah, this is you, Aries. That's your energy in the future. We'll clarify it a bit. What do we got in uh, the way you're influencing things? Okay, you got a passionate new beginning. What's your hopes and fears? King of Pentacles. Okay, something to do with the King of Pentacles. You're hoping or fearing this person. What do you got in the lens you're looking to? 
And then you're looking to this Queen of Wands could be blocking your passionate new beginning. I'm taking it upright because it wasn't fully. Okay, this is like um, your energy. I'm thinking yeah, definitely. Uh, Queen of Wands, easy on the eyes. Loved and hated. Taking a leap of faith possibly. With the fool. In the environment. Okay, there's a tower in the environment right now. Yikes. And somebody's strength is... Like somebody's losing a lot of strength. Hmm. Eleven. Twenty-seven. So maybe twenty-seven, seventy-two, born in seventy-two, or late path number nine, a Virgo could have dropped a tower or something like that. Who's who's uh, a Virgo who's like maybe like running low on strength, dropped a tower. We got in the um outcome okay somebody's in lost lack and regret the devil <laughs> the devil's in lost lack and regret wow. I don't know I'm not going to cry too much about that unless it could be a Capricorn but I'm not getting that <laughs> somebody's working hard at their hard at their craft and uh, yeah I guess uh, being like um, prudent and like uh, yeah they're holding back Definitely on the devil, I'd say. This adds up to transformation with the devil. So this is like, yeah, the devil's transforming his plans, maybe. Uh, at the bottom of the deck, we got six sailing on the calmer waters. Okay, we definitely got to clarify this. Oh. Yeah, let's close this. Uh, this victory. There's a victory in the... Um, in the Part of the situation, something to do with the Queen of Pentacles, possibly, and the King of Swords. This could be somebody like a with Earth and Air high in their chart, like Earth Angel energy. Let's see here. Yeah, somebody's work definitely working hard at their craft. Page of Wands is exploring. You'll get good news. Let's leave it. Hey, give me one on this victory. What's this victory all about, Holy Spirit? Okay. <laughs> reverse Hierophant. Oh, okay. Victory over Reverse Hierophant? Or uh, Reverse Hierophant's got victory. And this is five and uh, this is uh, yeah, this is like um, unorthodox practices like uh, organization or um, a coven or something like that is maybe had victory or somebody got victory over a um, coven or somebody got victory anyway okay who got victory here Holy Spirit. Oh. what's this one king of wands okay king of wands got victory and justice. Okay. I'm gonna have to go deeper into that. There's uh, the challenge is there's a Pisces or um, somebody's getting a different perspective of um, an achievement of a uh, slow moving night. Knight of Pentacles. And yeah. So with the hangman here, they could be feeling stuck, or uh, like they have to make a sacrifice. Something to do with a uh, business opportunity. Let's see here. Give me one on this uh, slow moving night. Who's this? Okay. Judgment's being called down on this slow moving night. This is divine judgment. Okay. That kind of trumps justice. We got. Um, yeah, somebody was paid. Paid for what? What was somebody paid for? Oh. Ooh, to reverse the world. This is like not getting, like, making it almost to the end and then just like pff, having it like swept out underneath you. Uh, that's a challenge. Okay, so constantly you're thinking about lights being shed on a magician. Who's this magician? 
somebody bring me a cup of love? And who are they though? Somebody who went deep into meditation and is in high standing. Okay, what, what's light shedding about this person? Something to do with lovers or a marriage contract? Hmm. Okay, in the past there was a higher font. This could be this um, reversed higher font in this future here, who was um, being a bit of a player, nine of swords, and going a little batshit crazy. So what's with this uh, higher font? What happened to him? Okay, he's in heartbreak, or he, he had his heart broken. So maybe he hit the bottle or something, or whatever. But who, who broke his heart? Or how did his heart get broken? Uh, planning, he's planning for the future, so that's, that's good. Presently, there's an Aquarius and a Sagittarius in your energy. Let's give me one that's Aquarius. Okay, this person's reverse the uh, luxurious living. We went on this uh, Sagittarius, the chariot, okay. This person's like gaining forward movement, gaining control of their environment and victory. Could be something to do with a Cancerian in a Sagittarius, or a Cancerian could be dealing with this, um, with the spirit team. What's with this Cancer? Is this a Cancerian or is this gaining forward movement? Okay. The Queen of Pentacles, maybe a Capricorn. They're with a the Capricorn, possibly. In the future, we got an Emperor. This is your energy in the future. What's going to happen in here? Okay, this is like all the... the this is... Um, when the moon's reversed, it's... Uh, all the secrets coming out. When it's like like this, this means there's something hidden. But this means that all the, what's hidden is going to be revealed. So it's up to... Loss, it's going to lead to lost life and regret. And walking away from what no longer serves you. And Spirit says that's a truth. Get much more clear than that. In the way somebody's influencing things is a passionate new beginning with the Ace of Wands here. What's this all about? Okay, something of the past. A page of Pentacles, a student from the past. This also adds up to seven, which is uh, Cancerian energy. Forward movement, gain control of your environment, and victory. Hmm. And strength with it, if you add on the uh, Ace of Wands there. Hopes and fears is a King of Pentacles. Who's this King of Pentacles? Oh. King of Pentacles, <laughs> clarified by the King of Pentacles. Okay. So this could be somebody with some, who's business owner or business Slavic. And that's all you're going to tell me about this person? Or is there anything else you should know? Okay, seven of cups. Somebody who could be in illusions or has a lot of options. So it's a two, eight, nine. This person could be a Virgo. Uh, the lens you're looking through is the Queen of Wands, easy on the eyes, go your own way, and taking a leap of faith. The fool there. And. Shit. This is in conflict though. This is there's a lot of conflict going on. Five, six, seven, forward movement, gain control of your environment is what you're, what it's gonna lead to. Okay, who's who's sapping somebody's strengths here? What's why is somebody strength all going here? Um, page of cups because of a surprise tower. I'm thinking this tower is surprised. What's this tower? Oh. Okay, is tower is like insanity or somebody is going to drive somebody insane? Okay, what's this tower? No, environment. The devil, okay. The devil's come to collect up something, I'm thinking, off of somebody in your environment. And he is in the outcome here. And it leads to this tower. What's he, why is the devil here? Ten, nine of wands because somebody's really really guarded the devil's really guarded why is the devil guarded why is it <laughs> because of a transformation or somebody was holding on to a lot of secrets when they were going through their transformation the 
this adds up to 17 and they healed, faith, hope, and healing. They healed their heart after going through a transformation. Okay, why is the devil in the outcome? Hmm? Because of a queen of cups. Okay, who's this queen of cups? Okay, the devil's in the form of a queen of cups here. Somebody who celebrates a lot. Who is celebrating? What are they celebrating? Queen of Swords. They were celebrating something to do with the, with the Queen of Swords. Okay. Why are they in lost, lack, and sorrow? Why is the devil in lost, lack, and sorrow? With the Queen of Swords. Over ten pentacles reversing. This is ten pentacles reversed. Uh, and because somebody's highly intuitive. What else do we have in the outcome here? Is uh, somebody working hard at their craft? What's this self? Okay, cheating, lying, and stealing. Somebody was working hard at cheating, lying, and stealing. And who is this individual? It says up to 15, the devil. <laughs> that adds up to 15, the devil. Why is the devil? I don't, everything adds up to the devil here. <clears throat> 10 of wands. This is going to ex cause extreme burdens. Whatever it is, somebody was cheat trying to cheat and lie and steal up to some working hard to cheat, lie, and steal is going to, this is going to create 10 burdens. Wow. Okay, somebody's trying to sail on the underlying energy, somebody's sailing on the calmer waters. What's this all about Holy Spirit? Ooh, a betrayal. Okay, after a betrayal. This adds up to a tower and something to do with an Aquarius. The King of Cups and an Aquarius. This could be a. Um, hmm. This uh, right here just adds up to justice. We just add that. This is a, yeah, this is somebody getting busted. The King of Cups. Somebody a water sign possibly? Doesn't have to be. Just somebody who uh, yeah, masters their feelings. Who is this water sign? What should we know about them? Yeah, they're holding on. They're, re they're releasing a bunch of, of secrets. So I'm taking it that they're basically spilling the beans on this. This adds up to the devil too. Never seen so many things add up to the devil ever in a read. Bottom of the deck, we've got explore and you'll get good news. I don't see it here yet. <laughs> what do we got in the? Uh, okay, what's the? Uh, what would you like to tell everybody, sir? Basically, for righteous rounds. Wow. Okay. There's a tower. This is basically like a total of people. What about this? <laughs> what about this time? Okay, it's gonna help you get a passionate new beginning or take a leap of faith from taking it. Wow. It's a crazy read. Okay, I need a let's get a uh, one of these cards just does a oracle or a, yeah, oracle card. Mary Sudi. Oh, this card's here. <clears throat> Forgetfulness and release of unpleasant thoughts. Mm. Okay, what's the good one? Fruition and the realization of dreams. Mm. Okay, so watch out for forgetful and forgetfulness and release of unpleasant thoughts. There, Aries. Have a good one.